Hello students, welcome back to the trigonometry and uh, today we are going to discuss 11.2 exercise so yesterday we did 11.1 .1. so now, today now we are going to do 11.2 problems ok so first we start with the evaluate so first he asking for evaluate the following so first question is sin power of uh, sin 45 sin power of sin 45 plus cos 45 so sin 45 1 by root 2 plus cos 45 also 1 by root 2 so how much we get under root 2 is a LCM we have 1 plus 1 is equal to 2 by root 2 we multiply with the root 2 by root 2 so here 2 root 2 divided by 2 2 1 ja, 2 1 2 1 ja, cancel root 2 will get answer first is answer is how much so root 2 is the first this answer second answer here cos 45 is equal to how much cos 45 here only 1 by 2 1 by root 2 cos 45 1 by root 2 by sin sec 30 sec means second data means uh, cos ok na cos cos a is equal to 1 by second a ok na cos a means cos a cos 30 is equal to how much cos 30 is equal to root 3 by 2 cos 30 is equal to how much root 3 by 2 cos root 3 by means uh, sec 30 means 2 by root 3 sec here sec sec, uh, sec theta means sec 30 2 by root 3 plus uh, cosec 60 is equal to how much 1 by sin 60 sin 60 is equal to root 3 by 2 means cosec 60 is equal to 2 by root 3 ok now so 2 by root 3 here so how much we get uh, 1 by root 2 into here LCM root 3 uh, 4 by root 3 means root 3 by 4 we get so here uh, root 3 by root 3 divided by root 2 into 4 into root 2 ok so answer is here root 3 divided by 4 root 2 so next we do here third solution third solution so sin 30 is equal to 1 by 2 plus uh, tan 45 is equal to how much tan 45 is equal to 1 ok tan 45 is equal to 1 minus cos x 65 is equal to cos x 60 is equal to 2 by root 3 cos x 60 is equal to 2 by root 3 so cot 45 how much cot 45 cos 45 is equal to 1 plus uh, cos 60 is equal to how much cos 60 is equal to sin 60 root 3 by 2 cos 60 1 by 2 1 by 2 minus sec 60 second tier minus uh, second means uh, 30 means cos 30 cos 30 root 3 by 2 no? so second 30 how much will to 2 by root 3 so it will be 2 by root 3 uh, so this uh, these are equal see here uh, LCM is how much LCM is 2 root 3 here root 3 plus 2 root 3 minus 2 to the 4 divided by LCM same LCM will come here root 3 plus 2 root 3 minus 2 divided by 2 root 3 so this one this one cancel this one this one cancel is equal to 1 is the answer for this question so fourth question so 2 into tan square 45 degrees plus cos square 30 minus sin square 16 oh. so here tan square in tan square 45 means 1 square 2 into 1 square plus cos 30 means cos 30 how much root 3 by 2 whole square minus sin 60 means root 3 by 2 whole square so here 2 into 1 square 2 plus here 2 cancel 3 by 4 minus 2 means 2 square here come equal and it will cancel also 3 by 4 so this will this will cancel we will get 3 by 4 minus 3 by 4 is equal to 0 so 2 will get answer ok here fifth question second square second second, uh, second 60 means how much second 60 is equal to 2 uh, tan 60 is equal to tan 60 equal how much tan 60 is equal to root 3 tan 60 is equal to root 3 and sin 30 is equal to 1 by 2 sin 30 and uh, cos 30 is equal to cos 30 is equal to how much root 3 by 2 so we do in the submit in this problem so second square means 2 second 60 means 2 2 square 
minus tan square theta minus tan square 60 tan square means one zero three whole square divided by sin 30 sin square 30 means 1 by 2 whole square uh, plus cos square 60 cos square 60 means uh, cos square 30 means how much root 3 by 2 whole square so how much we get 2 to the 4 minus 3 divided by 1 by 4 means 1 by 2 whole square means 1 by 4 plus 3 by 4 here 4 minus 3 is equal to 1 divided by 4 is the LCM uh, 1 plus 3 is equal to 4 4 1 4 1 is equal to 1 by 1 Okay, now 1 by 1 is equal to 1 only answer. This uh, total solution is 1 is the answer for this question. Here, third problem. Sin 60 is equal to how much? Sin 60 root 3 by 2 into cos 30 root 3 by 2 plus sin 30 1 by 2 into cos 60 1 by 2 only. So, how much we get? This total I, I wrote here. This one. So, root 3 by root 3 is 3 by 4 plus 1 by 2 means 1 by 4 is equal to 4 by 4 4 1 4 1 so is equal to 1 answer so we have to find value of what is the value of sin 60 degrees plus uh, 30 sin 60 degrees plus 30 sin 90 sin 90 is equal to 1 so here sin 60 plus 30 is equal to we can write it as sin 60 into cos 30 plus sin 30 into cos 60 we can write it as cos 60 so this therefore we we can write it as n a plus b is equal to sin a cos b sin a cos b plus cos a sin b we can write it as okay now this is a formula this is a formula very important you have to remember for the inter intercourse also okay now so sin 30 here the we can evaluate uh, so we can conclude as this both are equal both are equal so this is answer so fourth question also same uh, it is the right to say that uh, cos 60 plus 30 is equal to cos 60 cos 30 minus sin 60 sin 30 so cos of 60 plus 30 so cos of cos of 60 plus 30 is equal to cos 60 into cos 30 minus sin 60 into sin 30 so we check it out okay cos 60 cos 60 plus means cos 90 here cos uh, 60 means how much cos 60 1 by 2 into cos 30 root 3 by 2 minus sin 60 root 3 by 2 minus uh, into so sin 30 1 by 2 so what we will get root 3 by 4 minus root 3 by 4 is equal to cos cos 90 is equal to how much 0 cos 90 is equal to 0 na? so uh, this will also cancel 1 minus 1 0 0 is equal to 0 so we will get this also equal so we can read it as cos of 60 plus 30 equal to cos 60 cos 30 minus sin 60 sin 30 sin 30 we can write it as cos of a plus b is equal to cos a cos b minus sin a sin b so this is the answer okay na? so please remember this formula first one sin of a plus b is equal to sin a cos b plus cos a sin b so this one cos of a plus b is equal to cos a cos b minus sin a sin b these two formula is important okay for the next year here in a right angle triangle so P Q R is given P Q R right angle triangle P here P Q R here it is 90 degrees think we think like this here 60 degrees we think it so P Q is equal to 6 centimeters and the P at the P is equal to 60 degrees we, we write it out so what is uh, now we have to do so sine 60 is equal to how much uh, opposite by hypotenuse no so we didn't we didn't get like that so what we take here tan 60 we take okay na? tan 60 is equal to tan 60 means opposite by adjacent opposite how much didn't given qr divided by pq pq is equal to 6 centimeters so uh, tan 60 is how much answer uh, tan 60 is equal to how much we will get tan 60 root 3 okay na? tan 60 how much root 3 is equal to QR 
divided by 6 centimeters so qr is equal to 6 root 3 we get so we got 6 root 3 here and we have to find pr also then only we can find so qr and pr so qr is equal to we got and we have to find pr also so means hypotenuse so hypotenuse how can we find the hypotenuse hypotenuse square is equal to adjacent square plus opposite square opposite square adjacent hypotenuse square is equal to adjacent means how much 6 square minus uh, this one how much 6 root of whole square so opposite square opposite square means how much 6 is a 36 into 3 minus 6 is a 36 here how much we get 36 is a 36 uh, we common 36 um, 3 minus 1 is equal to 36 into 2 72 h square is equal to okay and h square is equal to how much we got h is equal to hypotenuse is equal to h is equal to, um, h is equal to and root of 72 we can so we do another thing also like this uh, how, how we can write it as uh, sin 60 is equal to also we can write sin 60 is equal to uh, sin 60 opposite by hypotenuse no we find hypotenuse like this opposite divided by hypotenuse hypotenuse how much we got we didn't got anything so like that thing like that hypotenuse so sin 60 is equal to how much root 3 by 2 ok now so right uh, here uh, h, h, uh, h will it come here h is equal to 6 root 3 divided by under root of 3 by 2 so it will goes reverse h is equal to 6 root 3 into uh, 2 by root 3 3 1 ja, 3 1 ja, is equal to 6 2 ja, 12 so 12 is the answer h is equal to 12 we get we will get so hypotenuse is how much 12 ok na? so 7th question it, is it right to say that sin a is equal to sin sin of a plus b is equal to sin a sin b so justify your answer so we do solution here so first we think it let uh, a is equal to 60 otherwise 30 b is equal to 60 we take it as sin 30 is sin 30 plus 60 is equal to sin 30 plus sin 60 we do like this okay now so sin 30 plus 60 is equal to sin 90 is equal to sin 30 is how much 1 by 2 plus sin 60 root 3 by 2 sin 60 is equal to 1 and sin 30 plus sin 60 is equal to 1 plus root 3 so these are not, not equal so that's why sin of a plus b is equal to sin a plus sin b is not equal okay now so this is we have to prove right so thank you children have a good day